in honor of this trip to Buckhorn, I wrote a little poem on the way up. And playing the role of Mr. Bob, a.k.a. Baby Bobby Brown, is Mr. Boris MacGyver. Visit to Buckhorn, August 2013. Looking back can make you laugh. We all agree the, time, the times were good. Except when they weren't, that is. But all summed up, we did what we could. Like the time I thought I'd visit the coop. Still in diapers I ran, but stubbed my toe. As a rooster, ruffled, then pecked my butt. Till saved from the ordeal by my grandma's hoe. And that be changed later, I'd ride with my dad to the pastime in Mitchell. The place for cold beer. As fellas be drinking, I'd sit on the bar for tickles and giggles, safe hands always near. A little bit older, I'd hop on my Schwinn, pedal to the creek with just a string and a hook, till skill and patience took skill and patience to know when to snag. Eating sized trout is all that I took. A trip to Buckhorn was always a treat. Cousin Dale and I perched on the front of a jeep. Cool evenings on the ports, lots of stories to tell. Those are the memories you'll always keep. The vittles were good despite what we missed. Grandma's orchard was ripe with the very best fruit. Venison biscuits were standard lunch fare and those daily beans that made us all toot. <laughs> now food in sheep camp was a different story. Cold hash from the can for the early bird. Just choke it down because that's all you're getting. Go count markers in Ochico. Take care of the herd. Some rules were hard like don't make rally, rally whistle. Some others, so obvious they needn't be spoken. Like shoot that coyote, don't let it escape. Sons of bitches, Scotty! Some rules can't be broken. <laughs> this brings, to, brings me to mention the fact that might shock it. Shock, at tender age of ten, I shot my first gun. An early start on a hunting career till my eyes met the does, and I just let it run. After years of adventures, some stand out still, like the time all the horses knew well before me that a flood was coming. Yes, in those dry hills, come fast down the draw. Lucky they knew to fly, l l knew to flee. And how about the time down Indian Creek, lost in my thoughts, I leaned on the tree, I came to life and gave me a warning, just Mr. Rattler, nearly the end of me. Ranch life's not complete unless you can ride, happy was me and the name of my horse. I'd saddle him up and go where was needed, move a few sheep or just wander, of course. My life wasn't luxury, it was plenty to do, with comics to read I never got bored. We had what we needed or so we thought, some white with paper, we thank Montgomery Ward. <laughs> but the entertainment's important, and we had our share, like the ghost of Buckhorn, who was someone to fear. Or maybe my uncles just needed a laugh. They'd feed me Tabasco. Yeah, their intentions were clear. I'd still be here if my mom had decided. Instead, we moved on. Said I had much to learn, and that I did. Most improved, second year. But the ranch is so special, I'll always return. And here I am now, three generations of smiles, a hike to Square Rock, Hanging out on the porch, surrounded by land we all grew to love. So keep eating your beans and carry the torch. <laughs> <laughs> Yay!